part of your legacy, perhaps, is this bridge. A lot of people who were your constituents love what you did for them. This is kind of overshadowed. So what do you say about that? Well, I'd hope that my 15 years plus of public service that I did for the city of LA, that people appreciate the work I did and uh, don't forget projects like this that I helped get through. And I'd like to think that I made a positive impact in the lives of thousands of people in my district and the city as a whole. And, um, you know, I just want to move on from this, though. Uh, I want to want my family to move on. I want the city of LA to move on. I love the city of LA. And um, I hope that I provided a positive impact in the city. Um, and you know, this process really um, painted a picture of someone who I am not. I know who I am. And um, I just hope to move on from this now and, and heal. There's a lot of healing to do. And uh, I love this city. I love my constituents. I hope I didn't let them down. I'm joking now. This is hard. It's hard. You know, this is something that um, nobody would want to go through. And I certainly didn't imagine myself going through something like this. Um, nobody does. You know, when they're involved in high stakes games and politics, you don't imagine you'd be in this situation. Uh, but unfortunately, uh, I am. And like I said, uh, I know who I am. And this process uh, made me out to be somebody that I am not. When I read the papers, when I see the headlines. It's not who I am deep down inside. It's not someone who I want to be portrayed for especially my kids, but for those who were inspired by my story, uh, coming to this country with nothing, living in poverty, but being able to make something of myself, provide for my family, and be able to represent my community. Uh, you know, and now I feel I let people down uh, because I had to go through this uh, and I just hope that um, people do see the positive things I did in balance with the prospects and what I have to face now as a consequence of my actions. You're, you're very remorseful with what you wrote to the judge and what you said. Today. Is there an apology you want to make to your constituents? Well, I'd like to ask forgiveness um, first of all to my family, to uh, the city of Los Angeles, especially my constituents as well. We worked hard together, we worked well together to improve the district in the 15 years that I represented my constituents. Had a lot of support even going through this and uh, I really appreciate the support. Made a lot of great friendships along the way. We did a lot of great work, but I apologize. I'm sorry.